Hey guys, so today we are going to gas things, which is why I have this thing that's coming off of my face, okay. I can breathe now. So some of you have been wondering uh, how to deal with plants when you get like pests or whatever, especially with carnivorous plants because they can't handle like a ton of minerals around the roots, but they can't handle it on the leaves and I can't breathe. So today I'm going to show, so today I'm going to show you guys what I do to deal with, um, ow. So today I'm going to show you guys how to get rid of plant pet poop. I'm going to show you guys how to get rid of pests on your carnivorous plants. So what I personally use is this thing, and this is the best thing to use because I use it. This is Bayer Advanced Rose and Flower um, Insect Killer. And this works for anything from like thrips to mealybugs. Um, if, you know, if you just see a bug on your plant and it seems invasive, like there's a lot of them and they're just like in an area, take them off. Like just use this. So earlier today, I noticed on this little plant right here, the Ventricosa by Ventricosa by Trustmodiensis. So the picture right there, that nice dark one with the stuff on it. Did you see that green flash? Great Gatsby. I noticed there were little tiny white speckles on it and those are pests. I'm not sure what they are, but we're gonna kill them. Insert the mask onto your face. Is that a word? Okay, insert. Does that work? No. And then grab your bare advanced rose and flower killer. It kills flowers and roses, but keeps carnivorous plants nice and strong. And now you're gonna turn it to the spray setting. And don't even worry about getting it on the substrate or anything. It won't cause many issues. Uh, now just spray the infected area. Don't even be gentle about it. Just go for it. You just want it to the entire plant like that. And after a while, uh, you may have to do a couple more treatments because sometimes they do come back. The eggs, it doesn't necessarily get all eggs, but it does get the adults. So if you do it about twice, if you time it really well, then you should get rid of them. It just dripped on my foot. This stuff is not supposed to come in contact with skin. I don't know what to do. Holy crap. Eh. Wipe it on the ground. Ow, foot crap. If it gets on your skin, wash your skin immediately uh, because it could lead to bad things and you can die. So try not to die. Um, it does smell kind of bad in here, so I'm gonna turn the swamp cooler on and head out. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up and favorite the video if you wanna come back to it and subscribe for new videos Friday daily. Okay, so I will see you guys next week. Bye. I'm gonna go wash my butt.